All right, what's good guys? Um, back with it just hopefully what will be a quick little video. Um, I ended up getting this Anchor PowerCore 13,400, PowerCore Plus 13,400 on Amazon at a steal. Um, so we're gonna unbox it and then we're gonna test to see how efficiently it charges my Samsung Galaxy Note 5 and my Nexus 9. Um, going to be using an app called Ampere that measures the strength of the current coming into the device through the USB port so we can see uh, just how efficiently it charges now the the Note 5 generally charges at about 1200 milliamps a second um, the Nexus 9 about 700 to 900 depending so based on those baselines off the wall charger we'll be able to see just how well this guy is charging my two devices so let's first of all let's take a look at the box uh, just a you know anchor logo on the front uh, the name of the device uh, we've got the customer service information on the bottom uh, the back is just some anchor branding you know use it on the road home on your travels blah 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 uh, top of the box some FCC and other information like that serial number so there's two stickers here on the sides I'm gonna go ahead cut these open and then looks like it opens down here at the bottom so we're gonna pop that open and then there we go we are greeted by the block wow that has some heft to it so there's the uh, there's the charging block, and then oh, pretty sick. We have uh, a cool little carrying case. It's like a mesh bag. It's actually pretty nice. I like that. Um, then we have a standard micro USB cable. Kind of wish that was a little longer. It doesn't it probably looks like it's about I don't know maybe a foot and a half. Uh, looks like it's about a two foot long cable nothing spectacular uh, and then some documentation I'm sure some warranty information not happy you know, how to contact them and then if you're happy what you can do to help them out maybe rate it or whatnot uh, and then we have your welcome guide if you don't know how to use a battery pack charger thing then you should probably have your head examined so we're just going to throw that back to the box, get that out of the way, and then we will tear this bad boy open. And you can see it is just all black, nice big power button there, uh, some FCC information down the bottom, uh, and then an input to charge it, and then two USB outputs. I thought, oh there we go. So when you press the power button, this lights up to give you the uh, remaining charge. That's actually quite nice. I like that. Um, so first of all, let me just check and make sure that both of these USB ports are fully powered because I don't want to go and start using them if they aren't. Uh, all right, so it looks like both of the outputs are the same. Right. So here we have the Nexus 9. I'm going to go ahead and plug the charger that came with it in. I'm going to get a reading on how much this, how fast this generally charges. So this is going to give us, it's going to measure the total input. It's about 900 milliamp hours. Or 900 milliamps, I should say, no milliamp hours. Somewhere in that ballpark. So now, let's get the 
Galaxy Note 5. There's my Galaxy Note 5. Let's open up Ampere, same app, and let's measure on its stock charger. This is with fast charging enabled, and let's see what this gives us for an input charge. This is <coughs> on the fast charging cable, fast charging power block with fast charger on, and you'll be able to see here fast charging. So 1360, so we'll say, you know, 12 to 1300. Uh, on its max. So let's get the anchor pack and plug that into both devices and see what we get for a readout. Alright, so we have the anchor battery pack right here. We have to connect the cable. We're going to plug this into the Nexus 9 and see what we get for, uh, for a charge. We we're around 900 with the stock charger. Thousand, ten sixty, ten ninety, eleven hundred, eleven ten. So this is actually performing about twenty percent better than the charger that came with the Nexus Nine. Granted, Nexus Nine is an older device; uh, it's about a year and a half old at this point. So uh, let's plug in. The Note 5, which you could consider, um, you know, a newer device. So here's the Note 5, currently discharging. We want to plug in the anchor battery pack. And we'll see what this gives us. starts off a little slow and I actually noticed this the first time I tried to film this we're around 850 860 so it's it's close to an amp close you know 1000 milliamps is an amp so you know it's about it's it's about 50% slower not quite 50% slower than what you would expect to see on a you know a Samsung fast charging cable but it's still respectable you can still charge your battery quite uh, you know quite well with this anchor battery pack this anchor um, power core plus or whatever it's I forget the name but the 13,400 so if you ever see this on Amazon for anything less than 40 or 50 dollars just grab this up great little thing you can charge up uh, the Nexus 9 has a huge battery you can charge this up two and a half three times from a zero percent the Galaxy Note 5 about the same uh, three to four times from zero percent on a full charge of the uh, the anchor battery pack so I'm giving this my thumbs up Seal of approval. I would highly recommend you guys go out and buy this product and replace whatever, if you're using a battery pack, replace whatever battery pack you're using with this anchor battery pack because it is well worth it. Swan Leader, signing out.